Get your dance on, because today we're gonna learn to jig. Just kidding. This is a jigsaw, and we're gonna be going over the basics today. The jigsaw is perfect for anytime you need to cut a shape out of plywood. So it can do curves really nicely. It can also do um, notches really well. Before we get started, let's do a little roadmap of the tool. You've got your blade here and then your trigger here. This button will lock or unlock the saw, which lets you pull the trigger or not. So if it's locked, you can't pull the trigger. So this is your base plate and that lies up against the material that you're cutting like that. If you want to do a bevel cut, you can pull this lever here and that will let you change the angle of your plate. And now when I cut, you'll notice that the jigsaw is held at a different angle. Here you've got the speed control. Um, that actually controls the forward and backward motion of the blade, which you absolutely can't use on metal, but if you're doing wood and you want it to go a little faster, you can bump that up. If you need to change the blade of your saw, you can just pop this open and your blade will come out, and then you can take a different blade, slide this along the track, and be sure to really push it in there, and then you can close that and lock it in there. So we've got two different types of blades here. This one is for metal, and you'll notice that the teeth are much smaller. This one is for wood, what we'll be using today, and the teeth are much larger. Before you try to cut, be sure to put a battery in your tool. When you're using the jigsaw, you want to make sure that you have eye protection, ear protection. You're wearing closed-toed shoes, pants, and form-fitting shirt. No dangling hoodie strings or jewelry that could get caught in the machine. It may be tempting to wear work gloves, but those can suck your hand into the blade, so we really recommend against it. Um, as you can see here, I've clamped my wood to a table, mounted up, and always be sure this blade is definitely short enough that it won't be a problem. Right now I've got the jigsaw locked, so I'm gonna unlock that, and now I'm safe to go. As with all saws, so the circ saw, the miter saw, the jigsaw, your saw blade should be going almost at full speed before you make contact with the wood. Um, and that's to ensure that you don't send the saw blade flying if you're, if you're jammed up against the wood when you start. All right, now let's get this show on the road. So I'm gonna start my saw. tool. It lets you get really creative with the shapes that you're cutting out, and I hope you love it as much as I do. Okay.